Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of my Sims 2 Pleasant View Let's Play. Today we'll be playing the Lothario household, and this is the now start of round two. Um, we'll be playing through our whole neighborhood again. Um, hopefully it'll be just as dramatic as the first round, but uh, I can't wait to get it, uh, it started. So let's just get into it. Alright, here we are with Don Lothario. He is walking around everywhere. Um, we have... Wants to be best friends with Florence and get a charisma skill point, so we'll work on those. Uh, he also wants to meet someone new, talk, entertain, and throw a party. But uh, he doesn't really have that many friends, so hopefully we can meet some people so we can uh, invite people to his party. Because he can't just invite all of his girlfriends, they'll all just uh, fight each other for his love. <laughs> and while that would be funny, it would also be pretty uh, bad for uh, to get a good party. Wait, let's see if we can be friends with Chico. He needs some guy friends. He doesn't really have many. Except for George. Oh, poor George. Him trying to propose to Nina the other day. That was so horrible. Yeah, he met someone new. Is he gonna go eat his cereal? Chico, no, don't. That's my cereal bowl. Wait, no. That's my cereal. Chico. And there's Nina Caliente. I would invite her in, but... I think he also has to go to work soon. Yeah, he works at 6 p.m. Oh, it's only 9. I would have invited her in, but... Can't really do much with her. She's already pregnant. And he has no wants to flirt or do anything like that. He just wants to meet new people. Go swimming. Reach charisma by the Milan, have a party, be friends with Florence. Eat that cereal before Chico does. Oh, our maid has arrived, and we have, uh... Sheldon... Can be. you dropping off the mail. Oh, he gave me a letter. Sim Chamber of Commerce would like to show its appreciation and giving me a free coupon. Oh, great. I think... Oh, he already has one of those. So I guess we have two free meals. <laughs> we'll have to take someone down then. Let's try to talk to Chico here. Dance with me, Chico. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's thinking about Dina. He wants to dance with Dina and be friends with Chico. We'll have to invite Dina over. Too bad she's already pregnant, because I wanted to, like, maybe we could start an affair and have a, a illegitimate child. <laughs> but Mortimer would be very angry about that. Alright. There's Nina again. Nina's always coming by. Sorry, Nina, I can't hang out. I gotta go to work. Oh, here comes the snow. Aw, oh, Dina just came by. I can't say hi to you. I'm at work. I'm at work for the next few hours. Alright, mop this up. I'm going to bed because it's late. He wants to woohoo and ask us him out on a date. He's off Wednesday, Thursday, so we can uh, wait until then. We're going to work on his friendships, I think, if he still wants to. Also, we're gonna get some of these, uh, wants for, uh, charisma. Okay, let's see if we can call up Florence. Get that relationship up. We'll have to call up Chico, too. There's maids here. And now we have bills. Okay, well, let's go do the bills. I like the snow in the game. Got work today at 6, so I'm not having him do anything other than just relaxing if he wants to relax. He wants to jump rope, so let's do that. I'm very excited that I tried that fitness activity. That was a lot of fun. Oh, he wants to kiss Florence and flirt with her? Alright. Let's call her over then. This is a lot of snow. Alright, Don. Poor Florence. She's such a nice lady. And Don's just gonna ruin her life. You want to. You want to kiss and make out with her. Holy moly. Well then give her a tender kiss. Come here, Florence. Let me give you a smooch. Smoochy smooch. Oh, can I give you a make out? Yeah, I can. There we go. Hopefully Nina, Dina, or Kaylin don't walk past. Or this Vanessa. <laughs> Burnt faced Vanessa. Woohoo in bed, woohoo in the hot tub. 
Hey, you wanna go woohoo in the bed? Oh god, don't get pregnant, Florence. Alright, I made her selectable. They're relaxing in bed. Oh, now he's got two bolts for Florence. It was one, I think. Oh, don't go upstairs, Christy. I think they're nude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you hear <her> scream? <laughs> yeah, I don't blame you for uh, wanting to sit in the hot tub, but uh, I wouldn't have tried to walk upstairs while they were gonna woohoo in there. Well, they became best friends now. Now he wants to be best friends with Chico. Oh my god, this is a lot of snow. Alright, they just got done casual woohooing. So we'll make points unselectable. Nina's walking by, thank god that she doesn't care about their woohooing. Oh my god. What is he doing now? Telling her a dirty joke. She could have gotten pregnant from that. I highly doubt it though, because let me, let me see. She's pretty old. Let me see. Yeah, she's as old as Don is. She's one day younger than him, but I don't see her getting pregnant because the more they get older, the harder it is for Risky Woohoo to actually work. So we'll see less and less babies, but it could have worked. All right, the carpool's gonna be arriving soon. I'm gonna go take a shower, Florence. And uh, we're gonna go, well, there's Gilbert Jacquet. He's like the other Don Lothario of Pleasant View right now. He's got like 300 girlfriends like Don. Alright, he will be going to work soon. So we'll just hang out. They can talk to each other on the couch. Why are you strutting your way to work? <laughs> John, go home. You don't want to be by Don. He's, uh, he's a little weird. I think I'm going to take someone out on a date. I don't know if it's going to be Kaylin or Nina. I don't know if Don would reach out to Kaylin though. Kaylin does have a baby. Wants a woohoo, asks him on a date. Well, so is Dina's pregnant too, Dina. Sandy Broody is also an option. He wants a woohoo, public woohoo, asks him on a date, woohoo to hot tub. Well, don't worry, we're gonna go ask someone out tomorrow. So but I need you to go to bed first. And I think we're gonna stray away from the girls that we've already uh, have bagged. <laughs> So we're gonna probably ask out Sandy Broody or uh, Claire Fancy, but Sandy Broody would be a good one to have in his belt. She's a romance sim. She would like it. Nina, it's just that Dina's pregnant. Nina's pregnant. Caitlin has her own kid. And I feel like, I don't think Don would want to reach out to Caitlin because it'd just be like awkward for him. Because he knows that she's a big family sim and that he was just using her for extra services. And now that he's not his maid, he doesn't really see her as that extra service anymore, kind of. I feel like he will reach out to her sometime, but I want to give her a chance to maybe get a life. I, I almost want to get her and Malcolm together, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I want to try it out. But it's up to them. I can't really give them. I mean, I, maybe I should be giving them a little pushes, but I don't. I don't want to. Let's ask us him out on a date. He's off. Let's ask Sandy Broody. Oh, she's not home. Player Fancy. Let's ask her out. Oops. Ask out on a date. You wanna go on a date with me? Let's go to community lot. Be friends with Chico. Best friends with Chico. He wants to throw that party still. So. Maybe we'll try to meet more people he can be friends with. I feel like he would not be friends with Darren because Darren sees him as a jerk for leaving Cassandra, so that's not gonna happen. Same thing with Mortimer and Alex, he's not gonna ever see him again. Um, we're gonna go downtown, and I did finish setting up all the places downtown with everything that I wanted, so we can go to actually any of these places. And, uh, I wanted to go maybe somewhere else. Maybe we'll go to the pool and the spa. He wants woohoo in a hot tub, so that'd be a good idea. They can't eat out, unfortunately, but he's not really hungry, so it's fine. Alright, here we are at the pool lounge. Alright, she wants to be friends with Don. He wants to tell her jokes. That's what he's doing right now. Perfect. We're just gonna try to stay close to them as much as I can here. Oh god, Florence is here. Oh no. 
Oh no! Don't come over here. Let's see if I can just let them talk to each other. They're gonna go play catch, I guess. Let's just slow dance with Claire. Alright, enough playing catch. We're running out of time. We're trying to be friends with her. Come on. I don't think- I think this date's gonna fail. I'm sorry. I don't want the date to end just yet. Come on. Come on. Get it up. There we go. Alright. I don't want it to end just yet. That was kind of lame. Because I, I was just, uh, having them do nothing. There we go. And she became friend with, friends with him. So that's really what we were trying to get. Is Florence still here? I need to find out. Yes, yeah, she is. Dang it. I want to woohoo with her, but it's not going to happen because, uh, Florence will get mad. He's having that dream date at least. He wants to make out with her. Oh yes, the classic make out. But now he's got that on, her, on him. How many has he got now? Three? Four? Five? Five? Six? Did Florence leave? I really want to see if she left. I think she did. Nope, she's still here. She's eating hamburgers. I almost woohoo in bed. Maybe we can just ask her to come home. Want to come back home with me? We can go woohoo in my hot tub. Alright, he's home. Let's do a casual woohoo in the hot tub. Oh, we get to roll too. Let's see if he gets him pregnant. Ooh, it was close. It was a 28. <laughs> Nice, we got that. He's gonna have his dream date that he wants. He wants to be best friends with Chico. He wants a public woo. Oh, she fell in love. That sucks. You're not gonna be falling. She's. He's not gonna be falling in love with you. <laughs> then let's go get our beauty sleep so then he can uh, woo someone else tomorrow. Don's up early. He was soaking in the hot tub for a little bit. And now he's eating his bagel. For breakfast? Oh, it looks like she brought some flowers for him. Nice. Gross, Don. Why? That's gross. <laughs> Maybe we can invite Nina over, because I know she tried to come in. Or Dina, one of the two. Let's just invite Dina over. I think she was ringing the doorbell like she wanted to come. Oh, she's working. Never mind. Never mind, Mortimer. You didn't hear it from me. Let's throw a party. Oh, we got another free meal. Nice. <laughs> I'm gonna have too many of those. Let's just do a house party. We can pretend it's like his promotion party. And then we'll invite... Let's roll to see who he would bring. No way. It is literally Kaylin. So we're gonna invite Kaylin. <laughs> we're gonna invite his friends. So Chico, uh, George can come. Sandy Broody, maybe... Uh, he doesn't have a lot of friends, so I'll just, I'll just invite a bunch of random people. Maybe, maybe Brandy will come. Maybe we'll invite Dustin, too, and see if he'll come. I know all these people won't come, but I'll, I'll throw a throw party. Oh, a lot of them actually did come. The mo people that I mo most wanted them, that I wanted to actually come came. Hi, guys. Welcome to my party. What does Caitlyn want? Oh, she's gonna come kiss him on the cheek. <laughs> she's like... Ah, nice to see you again. She gave him a little kiss. Oh my god, this is so awkward. It's just everyone. It's, Kaylin is such a shy sim that she's just literally <laughs> shuffling in her little knees. Oh my god. There we go. Now she's... She, he's getting her to dance a little. There we go, Kaylin. Yeah. Don needed to help her get out of her uh, shyness. <laughs> That's cute. A dance party over here. Let's serve some bologna sandwiches. I think everyone would love bologna sandwiches at a party. Don't forget the mustard, guys. Don't forget the mustard. <laughs> we need the mustard on them. Here you go, guys. Bologna sandwiches with mustard. There's not enough chairs for everyone, so just uh, take a seat wherever. Maybe we can call everyone to meal. Everyone can have a sandwich. Maybe we can talk to some of these people. Let's try to talk to Dustin. He came all the way here. Thank you for coming, Dustin. I'm gonna interact with my guests. Kaylin's sitting in the hot tub upstairs. Can I influence- introduce you? Influence to talk to Dustin here. 
Because these are stupid ones, but sure. Can you go talk to Dustin for me? Thanks. Once a public woohoo now, influence someone to entertain another sim and buy a car. Influence to entertain Chico, I guess. After he's done peeing, though. There you go. Go put those sandwiches away. You don't want them to. You don't want them to rot. Let's go talk to Chico. He still wants to be friends with him. Best friends with him. So let's try to get these uh, long-term relationships up. Let me talk to you, Chico. Let me tell you. Let me gossip to you about Kaylin, who's also in my hot tub. She lost best friends with Daniel. Did you know that? <laughs> oh, the party's almost over. Wow, that was fast. It was a good time. Oh, that wasn't bad. Good job. And now it's snowing. <laughs> George is like, ew, Sandy Birdie. He's pretty tired. Maybe we can take a nap and then go out. The phone is ringing. Answer the phone. I keep wanting him to answer the phone because it could be someone asking him out. Oh, maybe it is. Hi, I'm Marissa. Since my friend Claire had such a great time with you the other day, I thought I'd see if you want to go downtown. Sure. Let's go to bowl bowling lane. Why not? All right, we came to hang out at the uh, one of the bowling lanes. Oh, this is the small, ugly one. <laughs> That's okay. Look at all the people they brought. Claire was his girlfriend, right? Yeah, we got Marissa Bendet, Jan Tellerman's here, Susie Jeffords is here. Those two are teens, so I'm not gonna bother with them. Here. Talk to these people. Get to know them. Oh, he thinks Jan Tellerman's hot. Oh, he's got three bolts with Jan Tellerman. Wow. Oh, Marissa thinks Denise is hot. Marissa's gay. Marissa Bendet. He's, she's lesbian. We can talk to Marissa then. He can have some friends. I'm also very exhausted and tired. I need to go home and go to bed, so I'm just gonna let it run. It's a flirt with Marissa. She she likes other females, not you, Don. We met a bunch more girls though that he's interested in. <laughs> but he's getting very, very, very tired. So maybe we should go home. I'm going to end the casual group. I need to go home. Getting buff is easy if you got some athletic pals to encourage you. Don picked up a point of body skill. Alright. Uh okay. No, we're going home. Leave me alone. I'm going home. I'm really tired. It's one in the morning and I have work tomorrow. Alright, let's go to bed. I need to get ready. It's the last day of winter today. Technically today is uh winter fest so we can decorate the house a little bit all right because don is so a lonely man i got him the small christmas tree this is the last day of winter so this is winter fest yay i also put a little wreath on his table that is a little cute all right it is the last day of don's round nothing too eventful happened we just uh, made some more friends for him um he wants to keep making more friends, asks more sims out on dates. I do want to take Nina and Dina down again and, you know, rekindle his love with his other lovers. But I want to wait until they're not pregnant anymore so they can possibly get an illegitimate child from him. Uh, but ne we can also play Nina as well and she can call up Don and hang out with him. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at all the lights flickering on the tree. I just realized Don can't make any Santa cookies because he doesn't have a stove. So I'm gonna get him a stove. I know he doesn't have one because he's meant to be a bachelor where he doesn't cook for himself. But come on, I think he's he can he can uh, get a cheap stove so he can cook other things other than TV dinners all the time. Because I think I'd be sick of teeny TV dinners if I were him. Uh, we also need a fire alarm in case he starts a fire. So let's make some uh. We'll make some breakfast, actually. I have a toaster pastry. He's got work today, unfortunately. But I'm just watching to see if anyone comes by that we can invite in, maybe. Let's do the Santa cookies. There's Noodle again. That'd be cute if we have Don adopt some a cat like Noodle. 
This man's lonely. I think he needs a cat or a dog. <laughs> We're gonna make some cookies and hopefully not burn the house down. Oh, good do job, Don. Maybe I'll put this away though and save it for later. Because it is early in the day. Look, there's Dirk Dreamer. Alrighty. Just having him chill. He's gonna be going to work soon here. I know it's a very uneventful last day, but we didn't go and hang out downtown and go on a little bit more dates. We also had that party that he wanted. Invited Kaylin over, but it didn't get really too spicy. But he had an event. He'll have more time, plenty of time to show up because Dina will probably roll wands for him and Nina will roll wands to do stuff. So I'll probably have him come over. Oh, there's Tucker. Tucker. You're so cute. You're supposed to be the burbs puppy. I'm gonna have to help them help them get their dog. I'm gonna help them because if I can get- maybe I can get Don to get Tucker and then we can give him to uh, Jennifer or John at some point. When we can go and uh... Don't rip up my furniture though. Tucker. When I'm gone. No! Don't do it! I knew it! No! My couch! Oh no, he's just sitting on my chair. That's cute. Oh god, the hot, the tree's starting on fire! <laughs> oh no! Put it out, please. The phone is ringing, the dog's ripping apart my stuff. Oh my god, guys, I'm at work. But this is his last day. It's now spring. Pick this up before you get roaches. I was going roller skating. Oh, that's cute. Go clean up your, uh, garbage now you're <laughs> you just come home and your furniture is just ripped apart and you're just like oh all right we'll have to sell the tree now that was christmas it was very festive for don but don doesn't have family or anything but yeah this is it this is the end of uh, round two for don and now it's spring so now he's gonna continuously roll wants to flirt with sims all day long but that's something that we can work on next time when we play him. He is an adult. He has 12 days left. So he's got about two rounds. Two and a half rounds-ish. Before he turns into an elder. But anyways, in the next round we'll be working on this public boohoo want. Asking more sims on dates. Hopefully we can ask Nina and Dina around a bit. And have um, him rekindle with those two. Because I know he loves them the most. Um, but that's something we'll have to look forward to um, next time, like I said. So if you enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next round, in the next episode, where we'll be playing the goth household with Dina, Mortimer, and Alexander, and their baby, Alaya, and their soon-to-be-born baby. Um, so thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.